Alrighty, what do we got in store today? It's always a coin flip with this show, man. The first two episodes of the season have been some of my favorite in the entirety of the show. I think all the characters have really found themselves and it feels good, but there's still some questions left up in the air with Dimple, especially with him saying some ominous stuff in episode one. So we're going to hop into it, see if anything's answered. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to drop a sub and let's get started. Uh, oh, shoot, Tsubomi. Yeah, oh, karaoke. <laughs> We gotta start figuring out the whole Subami mob thing too. Mob has to start figuring it out. Oh. Ew, is that her snot? Why was it glittery? It is kind of embarrassing when you sneeze and like more comes out than you think, but I need even for middle schoolers, it's even worse. If they see my face covered in snot, what? Your reputation's ruined? We're seeing Subami in like a, a vulnerable side of her for the first time. I mean, she has terrible friends. Holy. Oh my gosh. Maybe that's who we need to focus on is her finding him herself. Oh. Mob the savior, baby. And he doesn't even know it. Oh, maybe he did? He's gonna have a tissue. Oh my gosh, W Riz, that's my boy. Oh. The one butterfly joining the other butterfly. Hmm. Mob boy, look at his glowing eyes. Yeah, okay, this is his chance. That's it! Oh, <laughs> that's all it takes. All it takes. Oh, oh. <laughs> Disappointing. She wants him to be there, let me guess. Everybody needs something from Mob. My goodness, everybody really needs something from Mob. So now it's to choose between either of them, like helping either of them. Oh my goodness! You're totally popular. Yeah, he's come so far. I mean, he doesn't even realize it. He's, he just doesn't think about things like that. <laughs> Dude, now he's gonna be in his head about it. Oh no, he was doing so well. Oh, little flower. Is he gonna ask for advice? Oh, there's more butterflies. It's, it's overcrowding the flower, man. <laughs> oh no. Does he want advice on like how to handle it? Where is Dimple, man? Oh, even people are looking at him. Yeah, dude. Wow. Oh my gosh. Oh no, this. Wait, why does Mob's face look like that? What is happening to him? Oh! Uh! Mob on high horse! Jiga Chad Mob! He's crying! Wait, was he actually or is it just exaggerating it? Oh my god, dude. I mean, the thing is, he deserves to be on a high horse to a certain extent. He's been through so much, man. Oh my gosh. There's an entire, like, culture about the divine tree now. And it's just broccoli! Uh, uh, that's the human race, though. They flock to things like that. I mean, they would if this was real. This is pretty insane. Okay, so this is just a narrator. Like, yeah, people are just flocking to it. Oh, it's growing because people believe in it? Wait, what? Yeah, it's just broccoli. Wait, is that Dimple speaking? Yes, it's broccoli. Dimple's using it? Oh no, is this good or bad? Wait. What does he mean? That's Dimple, no? Oh no, man. Don't tell me Dimple goes down a dark path. He's done so well since we met him. Oh! Ah, not Tsubomi. Oh. An audition? What? Why would they do auditions when there's a true leader? I don't know if he wants that much attention, though. He definitely doesn't. If he did, he would have taken advantage of this by now. <laughs> Oh, maybe he will. His voice even changes! Okay, dude. It's tempting him. Knowing that it would impress Subami. 
you to start. My goodness, this is so cursed. Oh, wow! And there's Dimple. Wait, Dimple's kind of flaring. Yeah, what did happen? What has he been up to, though? <laughs> it all stems from see you later. Maybe that wasn't Dimple speaking earlier. I think he genuinely means that. <laughs> oh, maybe Dimple's gonna audition. Mm. Okay, so I mean, he's being straightforward about it. Oh. The predecessor. I forgot it was called LOL. God, it feels like a million years ago. I'm I'm not surprised. I'm glad that Dimple came to Mob first to talk about this. Oh! Dang, dude! What is this ego from Mob? My goodness, God, Dimple! <laughs> Mm, no, Mob has made up his mind, I guess. It was tempting at first. Okay, so yeah, it was him that took power from the broccoli. I'm surprised Mob deciphered that. Is that what he meant two episodes ago when he said my time has come or something like that? True! Dang, Mob. Wow. Oh. You and me fell. Wow. Is this like the end of Mob and Dimple? <gasps> oh, man. This is gonna kind of crush him. I'm not gonna... Oh, my God! This needs to stop! And back to Reagan. Maybe Dimple will talk to Reagan. I don't know. Giving up on making friends? Serizawa, I'll be your friend, man! Oh, Reagan actually wants to know. That's so sweet. Oh, he is attending the gathering. Maybe he still hasn't made up his mind about auditioning. I mean, they would recognize him. He literally looks exactly like the posters. Yeah, this is not our regular mob. So much money, bro. Merge everything. 580,000 members! Oh, big monetary donations. I, yeah, oh no. I was gonna say, I hope Reagan isn't selfish about this. Oh no. He sees some benefit for himself. Oh my god, he's being shameless about it too. <laughs> Let's pick out your outfit. Ooh. Ooh, a live stream. Nice. Aww. Reagan knows how important it is for him. I wish he would th think more about how this would affect Mob if he were to do this, though. He's so small. Oh. Oh, Teru! It's always good to see him. Teru's gonna get him dripped out. Let's go. Ooh. The, was that the divine tree, like, rooting itself in the city? Hmm. Maybe there's something bigger going on here with the divine tree. I mean, it was made from Mob's energy, no? Maybe it has something to do with that. <laughs> Teru's just gassing him up. I mean, maybe they actually are like, oh my gosh. Maybe they're like driven to him because of the divine tree or like the energy from it. I don't know. Smart monkey. How much is 5,000 yen? Monkey design. What is he wearing? Oh. Oh, we don't get to see? Oh, man. Oh. Hmm. Oh, he's got it under his jacket. You tease. He's just got meetings lined up with so many girls. My goodness. Being popular is exhausting. Oh, they're all looking at him. Did Teru lead him astray with what he's wearing? Oh my gosh. What did Teru do? What is that? Hmm. 
Oh shoot, here it goes. And even Jodo, Rising Sun. I feel like Jodo would be a pretty strong candidate, but I mean, Mob is the candidate. He's the real Psycho Helmet. He even matches the logo. It's not a joke anymore! The fan base and the group match with the Divine Shree, man? It's a force to be reckoned with. Suddenly showed himself yesterday. Psycho Helmet song? Wait, who? It's not Mob. I don't think we would have seen that. Wait, what? He's not even at the audition. He's gonna miss it. That's not him. Who is that? I thought it was supposed to be auditions. Oh, he's creepy. Is that Dimple Man? It kind of sounds like his voice. Ew, what is that? Ew! No, because there's no dimples. Can he hide them? I hope it's not Dimple. Oh my gosh, it kind of looks like it's like part of the tree. Think of that tree as me. This is so gross. Oh, he said like the opposite of what they believe. It's like an insurrection of the own religion. Dog, what is that? Nah, this is not Dimple. There's no way. Is it like the tree manifested? Yeah, he is part of the tree. What? I'm trying to figure it out. Maybe it's Mob's energy that's manifested? So it's doing this for him? I don't know. It's very ominous though, but I feel like it is teasing a lot of stuff in terms of Mob's energy acting on its own because of the stuff with like the everybody looking at him, staring at him. Or maybe, yeah, he is actually popular now and I'm just stupid. But this is the first episode that wasn't as much a standalone in this season. The first two kind of worked by themselves in this one. I think it's getting us started on a sort of a, an overarching story for this season, which is it has to wrap up some stuff because this is the final season of Mob Psycho. I mean, yeah, it can leave some loose ends when the show ends and leave it up to the viewer to decide, but the whole Subomi thing, I think Dimple really needs to find his place. And now I guess the whole Psycho Helmet religion needs its own wrapping up because they have been searching for Mob since season one, like episode three. Those members deserve some clarity, man. But I really do hope this isn't Dimple and this isn't how he's taking it out. He's just decided to become Mob, basically. But I'm scratching my my head trying to find out who else would be the perpetrator in doing this unless it, again it is just mob's energy manifested okay so it's this the, okay yeah this is the day after everything she's not like hyped to see him hmm. has she just shifted her entire you know who the true founder is something fishy's going on why would she just change on a dime when she knows he's the real psycho helmet what game is this? No longer remember. What? People pray to the side. What is happening? They're being like, uh. What's the word? They're getting indoctrinated by the psycho helmet religion. They're so about it, gung ho. Plant roots. Is the tree like just. Yeah, it's going like throughout the city. It's all from the divine tree it's like the divine tree is starting to like poison the city and people are like starting to just get used to it and follow it we are slightly responsible i mean mob created it if they destroy the broccoli people are gonna be mad people are obsessed with it powder made from part of the divine what Divine tree parfait? Dude, isn't it broccoli? Broccoli parfait sounds terrible. Broccoli candy? Maybe this is why people are like so about it. It's like altering their chemistry in their bodies. Increases vitality. Mm. Brother! 
Oh, it's like brainwashing people. Oh my God. Wait, that was so creepy. Jeez, Louise. Holy. Oh, he realized it. How did he stop himself? Oh my God, dude. The like fake mob just standing there. Oh. Yeah, the divine tree is evil. Oh, Taros is taking it to his own hands. Buddy is acting fast. I feel like it's going to fight back if it has this evil intent. Yeah, it's protected. Is that a sword? Since when does Taro own one? Fake mob. Taro versus fake mob. Dude, that is so gross looking. I think it is just the tree incarnate. Although it sounds like Dimple. Ugh. Oh, no, it's getting to him. Or he's pretending. It was a tie turned into a sword. Maybe he's faking it? Either way, that's some really strong brainwashing to do that, like, over the air. Maybe it's the uh, essence of the tree. Oh! That is totally Dimple's voice. No, he did! Yes! I feel like it's going to take a lot more, though. Oi, oi. Boy, this is moving fast in classic, classic mob fashion. Dude, the voice is crazy. Tower's too strong mentally for him to get in. Strong emotions can fight it. Uh, mob's gonna have a great time. It's been the whole thing. Ugh, here I come. Damn, Taro is rolling him. Oh! Taro obliterated him. No, that's not it. Dude, the whole tree is still here. I think that's just a part of it. Yeah, no, it's going to be way harder than that. Oh, the plant guy! He owns a plant shop now? That's so wholesome. Oh, the tree is killing him. Wait, this guy's perfect for the job. He's drinking the divine plant juice. Everybody's losing it. Who knew having a proper job was so rough? And not taking over the world. Yep, he figured it out. It's not that complicated. And I mean, you see all the roots going throughout the city and it's not trying to hide it. Ooh, he's ordering the plant. No, it's too strong. It just fought back. It's way stronger than he expected it to be. My main question is this. Oh my god! That is terrifying. This is whether or not this is actually Dumple. That's the question. Oh! He's calling him out! It is Dimple! He just took it into his own hands. Oh, gosh. What is he after taking over? He has only ever had one goal, yeah. Ugh. I thought Dimple had changed and he had gotten better, man. I've said this before, I was cheering for him. Oh, this is so sad. I thought he was going down a good path. I thought he had already and it was it was perfect. Oh my God, that is so ominous. He's taken over the city with this. It was like a perfect storm. The tree and then people believing in the tree and then the, the growth of the psycho helmet religion. He has a broccoli to lift it, carry it off, sink it in the ocean. It's not a terrible plan with how strong Mob is, at least his powers. But what if it falls in the ocean and roots like down to the deep sea level? Then what? <laughs> They're just recruiting him to help. Aww. The dynamic with everybody in this show is so good now though. Like Reagan's been humbled, Mob's found himself. It's so good. Now, Ritsu's catching on to what's going on. Bob and Reagan haven't figured it out. Everybody at school's lost it. Hmm, good question. Yeah, of course. What a silly question. Who else would you pray to? Oh, this is what started Ritsu becoming suspicious. He was like, why is everybody just like switching all of a sudden? This is kind of creepy how quickly it's like just 
taken over and brainwashed the whole city. Reagan, it's that simple, but it's, you should be like more worried. Maybe Reagan is secretly working for the Divine Tree and he's already been brainwashed. Okay, never mind. I don't think he has been. He would he would try to convince them not to. Oh. Wait, that has the Psycho Helmet logo on it. Don't eat that, Ritsu! Stop! It's brainwashing candy. Don't eat it. No! Stop! Oh my god, guys! Oh, thank god. Oh, but Ritsu already took it. I thought Ritsu would see through it and, and, and realize it. Maybe he already ha Maybe he's already been brainwashed and he's trying to just trap them. Oh no. Oh no. Uh, no! You were supposed to be one of the good ones, Ritsu! Oh no, he already is brainwashed. What's happening to Terror right now? He had a feeling because it's all a hive mind. The Divine Tree just tells everybody what to do. This has to be conflicting for Mob, though, because it's his brother. What is Reagan thinking? Okay, thank goodness they ran. They're gonna have the. Are they gonna have to fight Ritsu while he defends the tree, man? And the tree is already suspicious that it knows. I guess the tree being Dimple. That's why we have to destroy the tree. Ah, there it goes. Kill the old man! Bro, that's what I was saying. Yeah, probably sees every conversation, everything that's happening. The monkey shirt! Your school jacket has higher defense points. Is he just embarrassed that he's wearing that? Oh no. We're gonna start being surrounded. Oh no, Jodo! Everybody that was in that first seminar got brainwashed. You just gotta head to the source. Oh! People just lurking. It's so creepy. It's so sad that it's Dimple, though. I hope this doesn't end with him dying or something. I've become so attached to him. Bro. Oh, there he is. Wait, Dimple's so big, no? Or was that just the perspective? I know Dimple's just waiting for Mob and Reagan. He knows it's inevitable. Why are you asking? Oh, he's trying to see Mob's perspective on it. Now they're not just innocent anymore. It's whoever's leading them, that's that's a fault. There is no true psycho helmet. It's their it's an amalgamation in their mind. Did I use that word right? I can't believe we led from season one to now and it's come full circle. Where's Megan going with this? What? Oh no! Oh no! Reagan's been brainwashed. Hold your ground, mob. Reagan, what? Oh, he's gone. No, yeah, he. he I, I think he is. This this is the ultimate mob having to choose to do something for himself when everybody else is doing the opposite. Oh, man. I didn't even think about it like that. Even Reagan. Oh! I mean, he said the only one, but Teru was trying. He's going to have to fight through everyone. Wow, they're actually letting him through. Maybe Dimple, like, ordered them to let him through. Mm. Maybe Dimple's gonna try to convince Mob to like accept it and just go along with it. They're calling him the original. Subomi. Oh my gosh! Even the Body Improvement Club. Everybody, man. Again, my my favorite part about all of this is how full circle it's come. This was all established from I think episode two of season one when the entire like Dimple's origin became relevant and and we got the whole psycho helmet founding with everybody from Dimple's old religion being like, okay, who saved us? We're trying to find him. And now episode four of season three, there's everybody in the entire city is part of the psycho helmet religion, whether they uh, chose to be a part of it or not. And now here we are. Mob is officially recognized as 
the leader, even though I think if he's able to stop all this, nobody's going to remember a thing. But this is the ultimate test of Mob making decisions for himself because before he had people behind him, whether or not he was that confident in them. Now he had to literally stand up to Reagan and say, no, I'm going to keep on going no matter what. Everybody is, is telling him not to, to, to destroy the divine tree or hurt the divine tree. So appropriately, this is his ultimate test in the final season of the show. And I like it. But guys, that's been it for episode four, season three of Mob Cycle 100. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to drop a sub and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace, peace.